everyone, it's me, Pluto. Boy, oh boy, oh boy, things are really getting stressful again for the two-leggeds because because the curve, it's not it's not flattening, and the stay homes are getting more serious. It, it, it's totally it's totally understandable that you, you're feeling stressed because it's been eight months now that you guys have been trying your best to keep your heads high and your hearts open. But don't give up. You can keep doing it. So, so for a lot of people, winter's coming, and that can be extra hard because of the cold and the less shining sun. But you have to try to, to make yourself some cheery moments, however you can. And, and you really have to do your self-cares for the stress and the purple meanie prevention. So, so, so one fun way to squish those meanies is humming. Uh, you, you just try it. Pick, pick a song you like and hum out loud for a minute, and for sure it could calm your mind and lift your spirits. But, but, but maybe make sure you pick a happy song, okay? Uh, don't hum Eleanor Rigby because, because that lady died in the church and was buried along with her name and nobody came. Well, except Father Mackenzie in his freshly darned socks. So, so, so that's not such a happy song. Maybe instead you could do the Yellow Submarine song. So, so sometimes your thinking boxes, they're so full, you forget the really simple things for self-care. So, so humming, humming improves the air flowing between your sinus caves. And the humming, it creates turbulence, which pushes more air out. And if you're pushing more air out of those nose holes, it keeps bad things from getting trapped inside with your boogers. So, so humming, it actually increases your nasal nitric oxide. That gas goes up 15 to 20 times. Whoa, it, it, it's the broccoli of the nose gas. <laughs> nitric oxide it helps open the air flows and it helps beat up the fungus and the bacteria that could be living inside your lungs so humming for self-care is really 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 for sure true so so also some people they do humming breathing which is called bromari pranayama okay or or, or, or black humming bee breathing I, 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 i'm going to teach you. you first you do a big inhale through your nose with your lips with your lips closed really tight like you have a secret. Then you exhale out your nose holes and you make a deep bee hum. So, so, so if you do that, if you do that for a little while, for sure it's gonna help calm your mind. Uh, uh, unless you have apophobia, because that's the fear of bees. So maybe you don't wanna do the big black bee breathing if you got that fear. Oh, oh, and also, there's a special humming snack called hummus. I <laughs> get it. That's a really tasty chicken pea treat. And when you dip your when you dip your pita bread snacks in that spread, mm, 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 that's your snack pouch humming with happiness. <laughs> okay, so 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 if you have other people in your bubble, you could play name that tune with humming. I, 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 I'm gonna finish off the class with with one of mine. Mm-hmm. <laughs>